Well, the only sure race in the U.S. House is one without a challenger, and that is exactly what is happening in Wisconsin's 6th District. Republican Congressman Glenn Grothman has the field all to himself, but that hasn't stopped the four-term lawmaker from speaking out. Capitol Hill correspondent Eric Rosales traveled to America's Dairyland to speak to him. I'm in Green Bay, Wisconsin, just outside of Lambeau Field and just a short step away from Oshkosh, Wisconsin, where Congressman Glenn Grothman represents. I talked with the congressman to find out why he wants to return to Capitol Hill. If this election doesn't go the way you and I want, it will embolden Joe Biden and his surrogates even more to push this anti-Christian, anti-Catholic agenda. I caught up with the Wisconsin native at a political fundraiser. He tells me he's passionate about what he feels is the moral decay of American values within the Democratic Party. He says an example of this is the LBGTQI Data Inclusion Act, which would allow self-disclosed information for sexual preferences on the census and more than 100 other government forms. But can you imagine sitting down with a 7-year-old or a 10-year-old or even a 15-year-old and the teacher says, Johnny, what are you? You know, what type of clothes do you like to wear? Who are your best friends? That's the America we're going to get if the Democrats pick up a few more seats in the U.S. Senate. Congressman Grothman sits on the House budget along with the Oversight and Reform Committees. He tells me his work on the Education Committee is a real eye-opener on how radical the Democratic Party has become, from critical race theory to calling outspoken parents terrorists. America's got to wake up now because we are so close to losing that wonderful country that I've grown in my whole life. Do not let it slip away with apathy. As for the promotion of transgenderism? Planned Parenthood thinks this idea of transitioning, of young people changing their sex is a good idea. I'll tell you, it's only any of the Republicans that are going to put a stop to that because there's so many loony people in the fields of psychiatry in that. Who would push that? He says it's a critical time if Democrats do well in the midterms. He says they are already working on legislation for federal grants promoting atheism. Although Congressman Grothman is running unopposed, he believes that it's important for Republicans to win both the House and the Senate come November 8th. In Green Bay, Wisconsin, Eric Rosales, EWTN, News Nightly.